VidCon day three. Here we go, it's the start. I, uh, how do I look? Good enough? Yeah, I look okay? I feel so sick today. I am, I have the sorest throat. My nose is, keeps leaking, which is totally TMI. But, um, I have a signing with the DeFranco fam today, and, uh, but I got my coffee, so that's good. It is hot out here. It's noon. I guess I'm used to walking over here at nine o'clock, not at noon, but. Uh, VidCon day three, today is the last day. I'm gonna try and show you guys some of the actual booths today. Uh, I guess you'll see in a minute in the video if, if I do that or not, but I realized while I was editing that I barely like showed you guys what was actually at all of the booths. So we're gonna do that today and see how it goes. Um, I actually really like being here. People don't stare when you're talking to your camera because it's VidCon and everybody is talking to their camera. So that's good. <laughs> channel and I wanted to go into a panel about um, creators that have a lifestyle channel and I don't know something I found about a lot of the panels is it's almost like the the, the hosts of the different panels are making up their own questions because sometimes I go into them and the panel has nothing to do none of the questions none of the answers nothing that they talk about really has anything to do with what it's supposed to be um, but it's always interesting to hear other people's perspectives and to talk to other people and to listen to them and stuff. So, um, but now I'm gonna go watch Philip DeFranco game a little bit because that's uh, something that I've always wanted to do. I watch him on Twitch all the time. So um, I'm heading over to the gaming stage now, walking down the steps instead of the escalator because it's healthier. Um, and I'll show you guys some of the gaming. It's gonna be fun. guests to come out. Let's give him a big hand. Mr. Philip DeMarco! What's up, man? Hello, hello. Don't, don't get a controller up inside of here. Thank you. <laughs> oh, you're all beautiful bastards. <laughs> so, Philip, is this your first book club? Oh my god, no, I've gone to every single one. It's just our family growing and growing and growing. It's amazing to see. That's pretty cool. Well, so, you're 
favorite gamer, obviously. When, what was the first game you became like really obsessed with? I think probably Final Fantasy VII. So, and yeah. so back to the old ones uh, via emulators, which probably, you know, if they're not here, Nintendo, they're not going to sue me. Um, <laughs> and then probably now it's like Rocket League. Like, I'm just obsessed with Rocket League. Yeah, hours and hours. <laughs> uh, Alright, main thing, who are you? <laughs> okay. Alright, that's it. Alright, you I don't know what to do with the nunchuck. <laughs> Oh, yeah. I was like staring him in the eyes. So, never mind. Well, that was fun. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I know it's kind of hard to film when you're in the crowd. Uh, Smarter Every Day is doing a panel right now in the Marriott. So, and it just started like two minutes ago. So I'm gonna run over there and see if I can get to it. And uh, then. I'm gonna go get in line to go meet and greet Philip DeFranco and Lindsay DeFranco, which is gonna be awesome. Um, and then I'm gonna go for lunch because I'm feeling sick today and I haven't eaten yet, which probably doesn't help. Uh, okay, uh, let's see if I can get over to the Marriott. I think one of the keys to actually helping people get over those sort of tribal associations is by not using the major buzzwords, not arguing that people are wrong, um, and, and listening. Yeah, listening is listening's important, but I mean, for, to your point, Dustin, it's one thing to agree to disagree, but that's not going to get us anywhere on an issue like climate change. Like, I don't want everyone to agree to disagree with me because... That's not like, what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying at all. I'm saying use negative feedback into your thinking algorithm so that if you, if you disagree with me, I have to... Okay, hang on, hang on. I, I believe climate change is real and man-caused. Let's say you don't. How, how does this negative feedback work? This specific example. In this specific example, I would say, that's awesome explain it to me, and I would then be quiet and listen. Okay, that sounds like no climate change denier that I know. So. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I totally agree with you. That's, that's my point. That's my point. Okay, so I'm supposed to be going to Philip DeFranco, and the lineup is already so long. You know what? On the camera, it doesn't look that long. I bet this is all out of focus, but I don't even care. Anyway, we still have an hour to wait, so I'm going to sit here for an hour and play on my phone. Yes, I am. <laughs> when you're surrounded by like 20 people, 20,000 people, you tend to get sick. So, um, yeah, I'm sick. So I'm gonna go get like a real meal. And then, uh, actually, I'm gonna go give those girls my card real quick, hold on. Here, I'll give you my card if you wanna um, I vlogged every day, every day during VidCon, so that's me on YouTube. I'm from Canada, I'm a Canadian YouTuber. Say hi one more time. Hi. <laughs> I'll make sure to put you guys in, okay? That was fun. I mean, they don't know who I am, but that was still fun to give my card out to people that were like, are you vlogging? Oh my god, oh my god. I have one more thing to see at five o'clock, and 
then um, I'm done with VidCon for today, and then tomorrow's Disney Day! So, uh, oh, my phone's ringing. Okay, bye!